going to head to LA Union Station and find my way to the Hollywood Arclight to go see Sorry to Bother You and it's limited release. Um, it's fucking hot out here. It's literally 101 degrees and I'm in pants. So that's painful. But you know, fashion is pain. <laughs> Um, yeah. <laughs> I'm dying. But we're excited. I've waited really long for this movie, so I was like, I need to jump at the opportunity to see it before anybody else does. So, here we are. Woo! And the famous clock and you can't really tell but that says sorry to bother you on the top <laughs> and that's what we're here to see let's see does it show better when it's zoomed out nope <laughs> look how cool we've got like the actual costumes. Yes. <laughs> that is so cool. Wow. Look how cool. They have Dwayne Johnson's shirts from his new movie, Skyscraper. It's so sick. Kind of shook right now. Dun -dun. He's like my real dad, so yeah. <laughs> they got the Whitney posters up because of her new documentary. This is so cool. Ah, I love her so much. Wow. So, um, as I was walking into the theater, I realized that this actor was just walking by, and apparently he was in Brooklyn Nine-Nine, or is, is in Brooklyn Nine-Nine, and I'll put a picture here somewhere, but he was coming out of, uh, Won't You Be My Neighbor, and he was, like, full-on sobbing, but, yeah, that was pretty great. So, right now, I'm just waiting to go in, and I got a picture <laughs> in front of the, the sign, and... Uh, it starts in a few minutes, so I'll be going in. Um, yeah, I'm super excited. <laughs> Look who I found. <laughs> he follows me everywhere. It's kind of insane. 